I was about to say, I just realized I am still in my werewolf form. Okay, I'm going to return to normal. Why isn't she in her cap and gown? This is actually a high school graduation thing. I kind of put her in that because I was expecting her to be valedictorian. Hey, look, I'm prom queen at the university graduation. Hi, this is Charity, and welcome back to the Super Sim Challenge. A challenge in The Sims 4 where we try to complete all the aspirations, get top level of the careers, earn all the university degrees, max all the skills, and do everything you can do for a single sim. Carl is just working on her university homework. I actually finished the presentation and the presentation is excellent, so she's now writing her paper. Unfortunately, we did lose Tornado, so we have one less horse in the household. We're down to two. And I was thinking maybe we should start doing some competitions with Thunder to get Thunder's experience back up to the Ultimate Horse Championship. Because I really want to keep one ghost horse in the household. And I did invite this elder over as well because Carla has a fear of death. Um, I'm not sure why. <laughs> I think two of her horses and one of her chickens died. Okay, stop playing on the yoga mat, please. I need to discuss my fear of death with you. Okay, that takes care of that. You can go home now. Oh, and I got promoted. Okay, I have no idea if I had work today. I probably did not. So I don't know when you get promoted, but for some reason you get randomly promoted either at the end of your scheduled shift or the start of the next shift when you are supposed to be in. I took a vacation today, so I think maybe she was supposed to go to work now? I don't really remember. All right, so we're a patron of the arts level nine, and we're technically supposed to be at work right now, but because we got promoted into it, I don't think it counts. So we're going to have to wait until Wednesday to get the other promotion, and we should try to max out our performance right now. So we're unable to negotiate, we'll just have to bribe for performance. So it only took 4,000 simoleons to get the performance bar maxed. So we'll also create paintings because I'm not sure if that matters. I think it does matter though if you accidentally go to work. Okay, we'll start out with show jumping for Thunder because he has both of the skills necessary for that one. Only a silver medal, really? Okay. All right, we're back in Moonwood Mill. I guess until my class starts, I'm going to try to get some of the collectibles here from Moonwood Mill and also work on the werewolf aspirations. So I just need one more point to get up to Alpha. And we also need to spar with werewolves and unleash the beast. At the local bar, the bartender is usually a werewolf if you need to find werewolves to spar. We also didn't finish the paths for the Moonwood Mill portals. I'm not sure which one we've done. I think we did the Magical Melody because I usually do that one first. And then the next one needs to be uh, navigate the debris and then find the garlic. Although this one only gives us follow the Magical Melody or head towards the garlic. So I'm going to go towards the garlic. And that gave me the path to the bunker. Now we need to navigate the debris from here. Oh, actually, no, it looks like we have all of them. Yeah, we have all of them. Okay, we can stop doing that now. Oh, we actually found a Moonwood wand. That is kind of nice. Oh, you should also check your pack resources every day because sometimes you can find the artifacts in the pack resources. It also helps to have the sniff ability so that you can sniff out the treasure, but I haven't purchased that one yet, so Carla just has to blindly look around. You still manage to find something most of the time, and even if you do have the sniff ability, you can't sniff for a particular thing. You just have to sniff for random items. We got a wolf be gone from scavenging. I didn't know you could get that, but that's actually good because now we won't have to make one again. Although I do believe that these things sometimes spoil. It's not giving me a spoil timer. All right. Well, I know the vampire one does spoil, or at least I think it does. Hopefully this one doesn't spoil. And no 
don't chat with Christopher. We are <laughs> trying to regain control. We don't need to snarl at Christopher. That would be really bad. Oh, thank you. Regained control. We can spar with you, Christopher. We also should probably... Oh, he's uncomfortable. We should challenge him for the leader. The only thing is I'm not... Sh oh, yes, I am a, a top level werewolf now. All right, after this spar, we should definitely challenge him for the leadership. I'm not sure if we will win, but he's uncomfortable and we're very confident. That's always a good sign. Although we did lose the spar. Hmm. Okay, now I normally do the honorable brawl. Maybe I should do the tug of war because I got confused. I was thinking that I had to do the brawl, but I don't. There's no rule in this series that I have to do the brawl. I think the tug of war is easier to win. And the only reason why I thought I had to do the honorable brawl is because in my series for the prehistoric werewolves, I actually require that. But no, we can do the tug of war in this one. We can take the easy way out. Oh, wait, before I do that, let me change the aspiration. I mean, I'm sure it would complete if I switched it after the fact, but I don't want to take that chance. Oh, and she won! All right, well, Christopher, don't worry. We will give it right back to you because we're going to go join the wild things. Here, you can, you can have it back. We'll entrust the Moonwood collective leadership back to Christopher. I just needed it to complete my aspiration, Christopher. Don't be sad. You could be leader again, and then I'm going to resign. And this is actually kind of a cute animation. All right, now I'm a beta, and we're going to leave the Moonwood Collective. Okay, you can either say, I've changed my mind, I don't want to leave. I'm going to take the cure. Pack life just isn't for me. This pack sucks and you stink. I don't, and then dot, dot, dot. So we're going to say uh, pack life just as it, you know, I don't want to say this pack sucks and you stink, but I am going to go join the wild thing. So pack life just isn't for me, isn't really true. I'm going to say I'm going to take the cure because yes, eventually I am going to take the cure, just not right now. And I think that affects what happens to you when you leave, if you get the friendship of this pack or not. Okay, why did that not work? I am, a, okay, no, I want to leave. Why did you not let me leave? Is it because I said I was going to take the cure? I am leaving the Moodwood Mill Collective. Okay, all right, it just took a little while. Okay, yes, we are still a friend of the Moonwood Collective. So that means we can still, okay, we can contribute to pack resources, but we cannot take from pack resources. All right. Well, I was hoping that we could take from both pack resources, but no, we can't. We'll stay a friend though. All right. Where is the other one? Okay. There's Rory. So we need to switch our aspiration and we ask to be a friend of the wild things. She should accept us because we're actually really good friends. And we'll just do the three trials. Yeah, we still didn't win the spar, so we will join the pack and then immediately challenge her for a tug of war. Hey, Rory, can I join? And then now, can you give me the leadership? Yeah, see, this actually gets you straight to the highest level in the pack, but I don't know if you can win if you're not a beta. Oh, you can actually win if you're not a beta. All right, well. What? Delta? What? No, Alpha, okay. I was about to say, so it gave me each promotion gradually, so I got all the in-between rewards, but I am basically leader of the Wild Fangs now, and I haven't really ever done it that way, gone straight to leader after joining, but that's kind of fun. I think I'm going to stay in the Renegades for now, because they are the more permissive pack. I really don't like the Moonwood Mill Collective, because it's hard to control your fury. If you accidentally scare someone while you're rampaging, which is easy to do if you fail to regain control, then you will get put on notice. And it's just not fun because I don't want to try and control something that is really not controllable. It wouldn't be so bad if try to re regain control always worked, but it doesn't. Even if you're max level, 
even if you're a good werewolf, it doesn't matter. You still sometimes fail and you will still autonomously scare people. So it's difficult to stop doing that. And let's go check and see if we have anything. Ooh, they have the pot shard turning, the figure verify, and a luna moth. Okay, um, I kind of want all three of those things, but I can't. I'm just going to get the canine figurine because I think those are harder to get than the pot shards. Well, maybe I already had it. Well, I definitely had the, the pot shard already. Okay, so I don't need that. All right, I need some more werewolves to spar. And actually, I need to turn some sims into werewolves. Well, I'm going to go on a rampage and basically bite a bunch of people. Well, you're going to be a werewolf, Prisha. Okay, the only problem with the bar is that everyone is pretty much a, an occult already. And so... You cannot turn them into a werewolf if they're already an alien, a spellcaster, a, or a vampire, or a mermaid. So, or already a, a werewolf. So, we're just going to have to go somewhere else, probably. But I want to stay here so I can try and find some more werewolves to spar. Which means I have to switch back to the lone wolf aspiration. And I do have a class today, but only one class again. And all of my other classes are on Tuesday, Thursday. So we just have to be careful that at 3 o'clock we will remember to go home and go to our class. Oh, I have to defeat Greg. Where is Greg? I can never find anything in this place. All right, here he comes. We're very confident, okay? So we should be able to defeat him, but let's see. Well, I managed to throw him out of the fight twice. Okay, so I'm actually doing pretty well. Usually, if the person gets thrown out a couple of times, that person is going to lose. And Greg loses. Okay, well, that was easy. I think the Ferocious Intimidation is Unleash the Beast. I'm trying to figure out what does Unleash the Beast. It seems like even if I... And I'm turning into a werewolf. It didn't count. Okay, yes. The ferocious intimidation counts. How did we just become good friends when I didn't know her? That is strange. Oh, Renee! You're a young adult. Are you still a werewolf? Okay, she is a werewolf. But I don't think that we can spar because she doesn't have transformation mastery. Oh, well. Okay, I know I'm acting evil, but no, Carla is not going to be evil. At least not. I don't want that trait. That trait is just not a good trait. Although it would be nice to get a trait and to stop all of this asking for self-discoveries. But I think for my last trait, I might want genius. And unfortunately, that one is difficult to get. I'm just scaring away everyone at the bar. I keep forgetting that there are university organizations to go to, too. So we're only a seasoned member of the Order of Enchantment because they downgrade you after every semester. And then we're a seasoned member of the Spirit Squad and a seasoned member of the Bot Savants and a seasoned member of the Brainiacs. Oh, so we need to get to some of those organizational things in order to bring ourselves back up to senior member. And all we need to do is complete homework and study for two hours. Hopefully just completing the homework will put us over the top. And it did. Okay, so I don't need to do anything else for the Brainiacs. All right, we'll turn a couple more people into werewolves. And what is the werewolf domination? I'm not sure what that is. Oh, territory marking and provoking Greg we've already done. I'm just picking the closest people available and saying, you are now a werewolf. Sucks for you. All right, now we just need to pee a bunch of times. Carla never needs to empty her bladder anymore, so I didn't really figure out that that was what it was asking me to do, but I guess we're going to just pee for no reason. Nobody's happy about it. Oh, it's the Bot Savant Bar Night. There's not even a robot thing here. Well, we can fix that. Oh, great. There's not enough room for it upstairs. Okay, it can go over here. 
that's a weird place for it, but I'm going to put it there. All right, we need to craft a chatterbot, enhance the bot, and craft a RC quadcopter. Uh, we need a mechanism and a computer chip for that. Let's try a chatterbot. Perfectionist? No, I really don't want perfectionist. That's actually a bad trait because while it does make higher quality items easier, it also makes you take longer at making them. No, thank you. But we are now robotic skill level 10 and hopefully we will not get zapped anymore or at least less often. I think if you make the robotic arm that you actually won't get zapped as much. Maybe we should make one. Oh, it requires a whole bunch of things. Oh, okay, so she got bookworm. Now this is linked with genius. So she should be able to get the genius trait just by making a whole bunch of robotics things. I'm going to say no for right now because I don't want bookworm, I want genius. Okay, now we're a senior member of the bot savants. Okay, and for the Spirit Squad, we need to taunt a rival, put up banner on rival sports arena, and start a school cheer three times. And we don't have an activity for two days, so we'll try and get that stuff done now. Oh, look, and there's a university student right here that we can taunt about school superiority. I don't know if he's Foxbury or Brightchester, because honestly, we can taunt both of them, and it, it counts for both. Okay, and just a little tip. You need to be behind the arena to remove them and in the front to put them up. It's just really weird, but it helps if you tunnel there first because for some reason werewolf tunneling cannot be automatic. That doesn't really get us too much experience, but oh well. We need to start a school cheer three times. In order to do that, you usually have to be where the Foxbury students are. Hey, I did not say you could pee there. Okay, whatever. I guess going somewhere ferociously includes peeing when you get there. This person kind of likes me, so I'm... Oh, it's maybe it's because I'm a werewolf? She doesn't want to school cheer with me? No, she's not interested. Well, this person might be. He's a fan. Okay. Alright, well, I wasn't successful in starting a cheer. Let me turn back into myself. Oh, he actually did start with me. Okay, good. Maybe we can start a cheer now? Is this someone I turned into a werewolf? No, I don't think it is. I think this person might have already been a werewolf. Okay, it doesn't matter if anybody participates. It seems like you still get credit just for trying to start one. Although it says successfully start a school cheer. It's still counting even though no one is cheering with me. They're all booing me. I don't know why. I'm cheering for Foxbury and this is the Foxbury Commons. All of these people should be Foxbury students. And some of them even like me a lot. So why are they not cheering? Oh, well, I finished all of those. So that only got us a little bit of experience. And in my experience, you have to wait a while for these to reset. And you can't get any extra experience until the next event comes around. Okay, so 8 p.m. is the next event for the Foxbury Spirit Squad. And the order of enchantment, it's 10 p.m. Well, apparently I have two papers that are due, so we'll work on that a little bit before class. Okay, I have no more roosters, so I decided to buy a rooster. And this is what, what the default name came up as. Who decided to call a chicken Kentucky? I would never name a chicken Kentucky. <laughs> Kentucky Fried Chicken. That is so cruel because if you name an animal, it's a pet and you don't name animals and make pets out of animals that are intended to be cooked. That's just messed up. All right. We had three very early morning classes, so we have time to do our presentation. Oh, we actually have new tasks for the Foxbury Spirit Squad. So we can put up the banners, but we can't take a selfie with the mascot. Okay, it looks like for Foxbury, putting up the banners is the same place where you remove the banners in the front of the arena. I don't know why Brightchester has one spot for removing the banners and the other spot for putting the banners up. Well, at least that got us a little bit of experience. I hate the one that says take selfie with mascot because I never see the Foxbury mascot 
the lobster just doesn't show up at any of the of the events. Maybe he only shows up at like the school spirit day and I just happen to never go to that one because it's during the Finchwick Fair. Yeah, that one is the one where you can just kick back with everyone's favorite mascot, Lobster Larry. Okay, I'm going to sit in on a couple of skill classes because we need to get our mixology certificate. And you can only do it during certain times of the day. So we'll sit on, a, on as many classes as we can for the mixology certificate. I have no idea how many I've already done, maybe two or three, and you need to do 10. And then also we need to do our homework tonight. So we can do that during the night. Caitlin is asking us out on a date. Okay, so I know I probably haven't gotten any comments for the previous episode, but if you would like to nominate someone for Carla's Betrothed, please leave a comment. And also, if you create someone on the gallery, it doesn't really matter what um, orientation they are. So I'm open to anything. However, they do need to be able to romance with women. So it doesn't matter what your gender is. It doesn't matter if they can get pregnant or get others pregnant, because I'm not going to worry about a natural birth, but I do need someone who can romance with women because I need to be able to marry this person. And you can't do that if they don't like romance with women. No thanks. We are in the middle of a class. Okay, it's between 9 a.m. and 9 p.m. So now we'll go home and work on homework. Right, we have to go to work. Um, okay, we can go to work. No, we're going to have to come home at 3 p.m. in order to go to class. You can try taking a vacation day. Sometimes that works for the same day as long as you're not already late. Okay, it looks like we are not late because it no longer has the yellow envelope over here. So we will get promoted hopefully at the end of today or the beginning of Saturday. You only go to work three days a week in this career at level nine. That is terrible for trying to get promoted. This is why I'm opting to do the terrible reputation and bribe my huh? boss for job performance so that we can get promoted every single time we go to work. Otherwise, it's just going to take forever to do all of the careers. And I fully intend to do every branch of every career. So I have to do every career twice. Okay, we reached the max level in the painter career. So now we can change careers again. I don't know how I'm going to keep track of these, however, because unfortunately James Turner's website only has one for each career. So what I might do is only check them off when I've completed both branches, which means I'm going to have to start a spreadsheet. Okay, so we completed the arts critic and the patron of the arts painter career. The next one we can do is the trendsetter, and that's a style influencer. And that completes our academic aspiration. Okay, we'll record a style guide and then we'll do our homework. Oh, honestly, my ranch hand never cleans this chicken goop. All right, since we need some fun and I also want to get the genius trait, we're going to craft some computer chips in order to make a robotic arm. Okay, we need to offer some stuff on the altar. Stop trying to do your homework, Carla. And we're a senior member already. Okay, let's see if I can taunt and get some experience. I'm not sure if it'll work if I don't have that task, but I can't find any way to get University Spirit Squad experience except for attending the event on Saturday. No, that didn't really count. Why is my ranch hand here? And why are you trying to craft something on the cybernetic station? Well, one way you can get someone to leave the cybernetic station is to scare them as a werewolf. And then I'm going to scrap your craft. Yes, I got the genius straight. Okay, we, we don't have to worry about these pop-ups anymore. Okay, I have to be careful and go to school at 8 a.m. because I did play hooky for my job. So what that does is it makes it so my college classes don't automatically make me go to school. 
I have to manually go. Oh, if you scare the paparazzi with ferocious intimidation, they also leave. All right, I'm liking the werewolf form a little bit better now. If you find a sim really annoying and you use ferocious intimidation, they will basically not only run away, but leave the lot. And that is really important because right now I'm not using any cheats. So I can't cheat to force a sim to leave. Oh crap, I went to class and I have not submitted this term paper yet. I hope it counts if I can submit it afterwards. I still haven't even edited it. Oh, that's bad. I'm not sure if it's going to let me submit it after I take the class. I hope it does. It should. I mean, come on. The term is not over yet. All right. Despite the fact that I'm leader of the wild things, I have to do the pack participation type stuff. So I need to expand and explore. I just need to mark my territory. Okay, come on. I did that not too long ago. I will do it later. Okay, I'm going to submit my term paper. And that should hopefully take care of that class that I had. All right, the only one I have left is tomorrow. I need to take the exam at 3 p.m. I cannot forget that. All right, we finished our marking territory and we are a wild thing renegade. Now we just need one more werewolf to spar and to unleash the beast. Oh, we have new tasks, good. And none of them involve the stupid mascot. So we can do that. We can prank the rival statue, taunt a rival student, and successfully start a school cheer. Well, we did unleash the beast and we need to spar with one more werewolf to complete this lone wolf aspiration. In order to find werewolves, you can often go to the bar in the Moonwood Mill area and the mixologist there is usually a werewolf. And then also the librarian, if they show up, is usually a werewolf. But I don't see anybody. It's probably because the library is normally closed. I thought that they would have a librarian here even though it was nighttime, but it looks like no. Now, one of the issues that you might have is if you play with werewolves, the people who you turn don't have transformation mastery, so you can't spar with them. And it seems like the werewolves tend to die out and not reproduce. So there are a couple of werewolves that will always be in your game, which is Rory and Christopher, because they seem to be immortal. And not only immortal, but they, they won't die for any reason. It's not just that they're immortal, they won't age and it seems like all the other werewolves just tend to die out okay these are all of the werewolves in the game rory christopher and at least one of these is a mixologist i think it's cassandra and then the other one uh, nikita i think i did fight nikita so i think i fought all of the werewolves uh prisha ayong and turkey are turkey why is that a name well anyway i turned those people i think and i don't think they will have transformation mastery but if you make a club and you add all the werewolves in the game although um two are not showing up that i know exist which is carla jr and renee jr for some reason they're not showing up here yeah, I can't spar with this person because they don't have transformation mastery. I don't know how you get them to have transformation mastery other than maybe meeting them when there's a full moon. Now we can spar Nikita, but I'm pretty sure we've already sparred this one. And unfortunately, it makes you spar different werewolves. Yeah, we can't spar any of the others. And I'm pretty sure I've already sparred with these two, but we'll try it anyway. What now? Oh, I have to participate in the wild things. Sure, I'll go give some gifts. Ah, finally, the librarian. They get here about 7 a.m. And usually you can spar with this person. So I don't know them yet. 
unfortunately, it wasn't one of the werewolves I already knew. And then, oh no, I need to reduce my fury. This is not fair. I won't be able to spar while I'm like this. Well, that is not fun. Christopher, please, can you pacify me? I cannot, well, I probably can't be pacified because I can't somber hell. All right, well, I'm just going to have to rampage, I suppose. What if I go to sleep? Because that generates fury. That will make me rampage faster, hopefully. Oh, that did it. That's actually a good werewolf temperament. Especially for one that doesn't need sleep at all. Oh, great. I can't... See, this is what I mean. I can't regain control. And Carla is a max werewolf with a lot of ability points. And she has a whole bunch of different skills that should make it easy for her to do things like that. But no, she's got to fail sometimes. Well, I guess we keep scavenging until we can regain control. It's a maximum of three hours. That's not too bad. Okay, here's the last werewolf spar that we need to do. All right, and we have our lone wolf aspiration complete. Now for the cure seeker, we need to harvest a moon petal. I think it only blooms during a full moon. So we need to, since we need to harvest one, uh, even though we have two of them already, we need to make it be the full moon faster. Actually, I think the full moon is tomorrow night. So I'm going to leave it alone and we'll come back on Saturday night, which will be the very end of this episode and we should be able to get that then we need to collect wolf spain and even though i have a wolf be gone i need to craft one now we still won't be able to switch carla out of werewolf mode unless we can finish all of these abilities and complete the werewolf collection because the werewolf collection is a lot easier to complete as a werewolf so we need one, two, three, four, five, six more abilities. Technically, this Lunar Howl is not necessary because you can purchase it again and again. And actually, no, this one also turns into satisfaction points. So I guess if we purchase it once, we can count it as complete because you can purchase that one over and over again. And I believe you can also purchase this one over and over again or maybe you just purchase it once and then you can do the lunar howl as many times as you want oh okay so yes the legacy of the lichen can be taken multiple times the lunar howl i think it yeah it transforms your temperaments and you get the ability to do it by buying it so the legacy of the lichen is not really necessary to purchase because you can purchase that one multiple times. We did stay here all night though, so there is Wolf Spain. Okay, yes, the trick works where if you take it out of your inventory and put it back in, that also counts as, oh, even taking it out of your inventory counts as collecting Wolf Spain. Okay, well, we've done that. Although I have 26 Wolf Spain in my inventory, so yes, I did collect 10 Wolf Spain. That's not actually cheating. That's just uh, reminding the game that I already have it. All right. I do have two moon petal. It says I have to harvest it. I wonder if I just pick it up in my inventory if it counts. No, if you just pick it up in your inventory, it doesn't count. Okay. I think I'm just missing one of the tablets for the Moonwood relics. But I'm also missing one of the wolves on my shelf so maybe it's at the store i'll have to double check that oh okay good it's at the store i actually have a bunch of them here so renga was the one that i don't have on my shelf at home and i'm still missing that one tablet so i'm almost done with the werewolf collection okay i suppose we should read the diary of greg because for some reason we don't know how to craft a wolf be gone Okay, so that was the last course that we had to take. We took the exam. So we have a game day party, and I'm just going to try and play Juice Pong over and over again. Because every time you start a Juice Pong, it gives you credit for 
the Foxbury Spirit Squad. But you don't have to finish it. Normally, I don't like spamming things like this, but it's annoying because there's no social interactions other than playing juice pong that allow you to get experience. Hey, I want to play juice pong. Go away. Okay, so we got our final grades and we have an A+. So now we have a biology degree and we have to wait a while before we can register again, I'm pretty sure. In fact, I don't think we're going to get any more organizational credit right now because we're technically not a student. No, we're no longer getting any credit. Great. Well, I can stop doing this for now. Okay, I reached mixology level 10 again. Still don't have the certificate. I'm not sure how many times I've done the class. Uh, that's kind of bad because I won't know if it's glitching or not. It used to be if you sat in on a different skill class, you could get credit for the mixology certificate, but not anymore. Well, let's sit in on a rock climbing class. I need to max that out anyway. And we maxed out the rock climbing skill. Okay, well, that's a good way to max out rock climbing because rock climbing is really hard to get by doing it. But most of the other things are pretty easy to get by doing it. Okay, we'll convince oh, our boss no, to give us a bonus. Oh, no, never mind. It, don't do that, Carla. Oh, she did it already. No, she didn't. Okay, good. We need to take a vacation day. Or we can play hooky. Let's try playing hooky. Okay, work is in four days. And there's some things that you can do about the style influencer board. I wonder if you can only do it as a style influencer. You need an impression buff active. I think that you just have to get an impression from something. Okay, you click on an art piece and you click assess impression. Okay, I don't think she got an impression. No, she did not. Okay, that one gave her an impression. Now, what can you do? Oh, you can plan outfits and you can add another impression, but I have to get one probably to add one. Okay, I don't like the hunting ability. They randomly go hunting, even if they're not hungry. Why is that? Oh, the graduation ceremony starts in an hour. Should we go to the Finchwick Fair or the graduation ceremony? I kind of wanted to go to the graduation ceremony once for Foxbury, so it kind of stinks that it is today. And we might miss the fair. We'll try to do both. I was about to say, I just realized I am still in my werewolf form. Oh, that's interesting. I'm going to return to normal. Ah, I hate this area. Okay, I'm going to return to normal because I don't want her to be a werewolf right now. And her clothes are kind of interesting. Why isn't she in her cap and gown? That's not one of her normal outfits either. This is actually a high school graduation thing. I kind of put her in that because I was expecting her to be valedictorian. And I didn't want her to be not in her high school graduation uniform. Ah, stupid thing is. Okay, they're going in. They should come out and... Oh, and she got the crown. They should come out in time, hopefully. Oh, there's Lobster Larry. There actually is one. Where were you when I needed to take a picture of you or take a selfie with you? You didn't show up to any of the events, but you show up to graduation when I don't need you. Okay, she's still in her high school graduation thing. Hey, look, I'm prom queen at the university graduation. Yeah, if you're ever too busy to empty out your dumpster, just sell it and buy a new one. Okay, we will be losing our oversized aubergine that is perfect and weighs 15.66 kilograms okay we're going to the fair before it starts there seems to be a problem with sims finishing books in the sims 4 so basically when you select to read a book it almost immediately quits it and it never finishes the book unless you queue it up a whole bunch of times and then they'll spend maybe five or ten minutes reading it and then move on to the next one so this amount of reading might get through the book once 
All right, it's almost 3.30. It's time for the Finchwick Fair to appear in three, two, one. There we go. All right, and we want to immediately try to enter this competition. Let's stop reading the book, Carla. Oh, this isn't the oversized crop. This is the garden fair. Oh, I made a mistake. I have my aubergine in my inventory and it is going to spoil. Well, what if I submit a perfect death flower? What will that get me? Really? This is the garden fair? I thought it was the oversized crop one. Well, I don't have any pies. Well, hopefully it'll be fine. It doesn't spoil for six days. So I can go back home and put it in my household inventory again and it will be fine. Let me just keep reading my book. This time I'm not going to speak to the mayor at all. Stop bothering me for pictures. I need to read my book. Well, now we're best friends with the mayor and I did that through Social Bunny. So hopefully that will help my chances. Oh yes, and I should change this aspiration. That would suck if it wasn't active and I won. You have to read this book way too many times to get the cure. Oh, we can enroll in a university now. Before it's Monday, good. Okay, I want to do a Foxbury one next because I didn't finish the Spirit Squad at Foxbury and I don't want to start over. So we're going to skip communications for now because that one's not a distinguished degree and go for computer science next. And then we'll go back and do communications again. And notice once you already have the degree, you can't go and get it again. So you have to be careful that you pick the distinguished degree the first time. And I don't care about the scholarships. I'm not going to worry about it. But we will do our homework and stop reading the diary. Okay, she's actually judging my entry. So hopefully this will not glitch. Maybe I'll leave it at slower speeds because last time or actually every time I do this, I usually play at triple speed because I'm so impatient. This process takes too long and I'm just doing my homework, but maybe I can let the fair play out and actually sit next to it because last time I was also over here at the bar and I don't know, it just glitched out, didn't give me my stuff back and didn't give me any sort of prize, even a consolation prize. I actually kept my senior membership and all of the, the, of the different ones, except for a seasoned member. Oh man, it reset me on Foxbury. That's not nice. And I have take a selfie with my mascot, great. Okay, it's over at 9.30, so I'm going to go very slow and hopefully we will at least get some sort of placement in the competition. That's what I really care about. If they take my item, so what? I mean, so be it. I can get the items back again, but I don't like it when I don't even get a placement. I should get a participation ribbon for second or third place, at least one of those. Okay, it says the festival will end in one hour, but technically it should have ended at 9.30. Okay, it looks like the mayor loves it because she was looking at it and she had a heart above her head. So hopefully we win this competition. All right, it's 1030. Everything is supposed to be disappearing now. All right, it's slowly going away. Well, I wanted to play until the very end. So, you, oh, it said I almost canceled it too. I had, all right. So here's a way to make sure that you get your prize. It was actually a little thing in my queue and she was going to hand it to me. I canceled it, but it's still executed. So you have to be in the area around 10, 45, 11 p.m. And the mayor actually hands you the prize. And did I get my flower back? I'm not even sure because I had a whole bunch of death flowers in my inventory anyway. Oh, and I got a midnight treat. That's the only one that I don't have. And I got first place in the garden competition. Well, I almost forgot. I want to harvest the moon petals. So this is Charity. Thanks for watching.